Now, last time didn't go so well. But we have arrived at the hospital now. And I'm going to be engaging dungeon protocol. Ignore this, I streamed this briefly. And, as predicted, I did end up blue screening. As I was saving the game, actually, so that's not even where I got up to. But as I predicted, it is very, very easy to do this way faster than I have been. <laughs> with even the most rudimentary knowledge of where to go or where to be. And I've also noticed that I've played it a little bit without actually streaming or recording, and it is so much easier. Talking, I guess, just makes me really, really bad at keeping track of what I'm doing. Way beyond what I realized I was actually normally like when not doing so. So I at least feel a little bit less bad. I see a drink. Still don't seem to be able to speak to her. But okay. Follow the left wall. Don't- oh! That was horrifying. Okay, something's written on a typewriter. So that's already helpful. Uh, the potential for this illness exists in all people, and under the right circumstances, any man or woman could be driven, like him, to the other side. Yes, I'm exempt. The other side, perhaps, may not be the best way to phrase it. After all, there is no wall between here and there. It lies on the borders where reality and unreality intersect. It is a place both close and distant. Some say it isn't even an illness. I cannot agree with them. I'm a doctor, not a philosopher or even a psychiatrist. But sometimes I have to ask myself this question. It's true that to us his imaginings are nothing but the inventions of a busy mind, but to him, there simply is no other reality. Furthermore, he's happy there. So why, I ask myself, why in the name of healing him must we drag him painfully into the world of our own reality? Something else is written by hand. I got the key from Joseph. It's probably the key to that box. Okay. Oh, I got the purple bull key. Sounds like a knockoff energy drink, but here we are. Anything else? Oh, there was something, but I mispressed. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Good advice. Different types of papers and documents, but there's nothing of interest. Okay. I almost feel like it's misleading putting that next to an actual document of interest, especially with her stood in the way, but... She's helping. We're a team. So it would be nice to get a map. Hopefully it's not going to hold out on me for too long in that regard, because... God, she... She's just gonna keep scaring me with that, isn't she? Is she gonna jump scare me a little bit in every room? Because... I don't care for that. Map? Oh! Wonderful. So we're gonna follow the left room from the entrance door. Rather than the door I just came out of. Follow the left wall, rather. I think I feel like I said room. I can't even hear myself. I fully intend, for once, to make legitimate record time on this fog walk. Though I don't think we'll be seeing any fog today. I feel like we're going to be trapped in this dungeon for a while. Also, I can't go anywhere. The anti-Gretchen. Not so many aunties. We could have an auntie team type auntie. Like counter. Oops, sorry, what was that? I'm pressing the buttons, but the elevator doesn't move. You're not pressing the buttons, I'm looking at your hands. She knows you're lying, James. Can I go anywhere? This looks safe and nice and cool. Oh, okay. Jesus, lady. Um, okay, so that's a star wall. We'll loop back around here. Where is this on the map? I mean, it'll probably represent the stars, right? Yes, it does. Okay. I'm just walking around crossing off doors. Oh my god! Why is she like this? <laughs> I don't understand. I can't get the door. Oh. 
get some hospital type noises. No static though, I don't think we're actually under attack. And that's locked. 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 One of these days. Something posted on the bulletin board, but it's not really anything of interest. And we've come full circle. Alright, back to the stairwell, I think. It's possible I missed a door. Oh no, we tried every... We didn't try... We couldn't get to kitchen, it was blocked, right? Those two doors were blocked, I'm pretty sure. So in terms of locked doors, what have we got? Examination room. What looks to be some kind of hallway to... Patients' rooms, maybe? Cells? Um... Yeah. Time to move on. Where's she gonna be? I see you there, creeping. I see you. Excuse me, excuse me. Okay, well, it doesn't look like I can do anything down there anyway, but she's determined to block me regardless, so... So never mind. Huh, no door. Okay, that's a door. We're gonna be systematically walking through. Top to bottom. So... Oh shit. Oh fuck. That's bad. Ow. Oh, that's real bad. Okay. Not handling this very well so far. Yeah, okay, James. Have a quick drink. <laughs> That'll make it bad, then. But Maria, what are you... Whoa! They're everywhere! Maria, please! Oh god, I can't see. Oh god, she's gonna get killed. Stop! Stop it! She's not helping. She's really not helping at all. James, you fuck! Hit it! Oh, Christ. I'm gonna kill the entire hospital staff. I don't feel good about that. Who's gonna take care of the thing with legs for arms? It needs medical attention, I just beat it and then stepped on its head. Is it ever gonna let me speak to her? It doesn't seem to want to. <laughs> oh, I can look around while I'm blocking, huh? Ooh, I can see the ceiling. Well, the static's gone, so... Hopefully we've at least cleared the hallway of... ...medical staff and patients. <laughs> Feeling pretty good about myself. Feeling like a, a good person. This is the door I came in through. Wait, no. This is? I think? It is, okay. So the door behind me, if it's open, it's gonna go to some new rooms. Makes more sense to check these first. Also, how badly did I just get slashed? Oh, pretty badly. Uh-oh. Okay. <laughs> gonna have to keep an eye on that. The game told me my controller would vibrate when I was very wounded. It has never vibrated. I have died though, so then again I got one-shotted. So I can't actually determine whether or not it would vibrate. Cuddly toy. Hmm. Ow! What's wrong? I just pricked myself. It bit Are me. Are you okay? Yeah. Okay, I gotta... <laughs> I've got the bent needle now. Is 
Is there anything else? The locker won't open. The locker won't... Oh, there is. Hello. Excuse me. Why are you standing in front of that? What's wrong with you? There's a whole shotgun here. I would have missed it if you'd stood there. Good job she is gently shuntable. I presume that doesn't come with any shells. What? What? What the fuck? Why would they respawn? What the fuck is that noise? Maybe I should switch to a gun. Oh my god, now what the fuck is happening? Spin, James. Okay, okay, okay. This is okay. It's getting closer. It, it looks like a regular knife, so I don't know. Okay, okay. Why did that respawn? Did I not step on its face? That's messed up. Oh, we got a lady. It's a fit. Oh, and another one. How does she get in the rooms before me? It's so clearly deliberate and it's very unsettling. There's something inside the pocket of the white lab jacket. I got the examination room key. Okay. Examination room. Well, we got examining room three. And examining room four. On the third floor. And we've got... Examining room two. Oh, there it is. Examination room. It's the locked one in the middle. Oh, there's a door I didn't try in the middle there, I think. I didn't notice that. Is there anything else in here? Magazine. Won't do me any good right now. Okay. Please don't have respawned again, because I did not care for that noise. Okay, we're all good. Sorry, sorry. Did I try this? I did try this. Try the one at the end, then hit the stairs again. Oh dear. Bullets. Um. Okay. Do I want to do this now? No, I don't. I'd like to... Get out the way! I'd like to go and use my key, please. <laughs> I don't... <laughs> I don't like it. Then again, what's going on upstairs as well? Is it locked? It was on the map as a place. I feel like maybe it won't be accessible yet. Or was that it? Did I... Nope. Regular wall. Oh, I see. Oh, wait. RF. Okay, so the roof, I, what I presume at least to be the roof, is logged. Oh, God. What? Okay, okay. What is it? What is it? Oh, God, lady, you're gonna fucking kill me with this. James, you need to look. The, the camera doesn't give a shit. It's forsaken me. Uh oh. Okay. Just keep on piping the nurse, it's gonna be fine. Is that everybody? I think that might be everybody. So is this... Same floor plan as before. Ooh. Nice. Seems to be the same floor plan. 
broken lock. Deadlift. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Broken lock. Mercifully small amount of doors actually let me through here. That looks like something I don't... I don't know. And then there's that hallway. Okay. We'll try this thing. Okay, it's locked. Wonderful. What is that room supposed to be? Special treatment room. Okay. Doesn't seem like there's a way into the day room, so... Cutscene? Okay, keypad. Um... Okay. No idea. Like, I'm pretty sure I have no idea. We got the doctor's journal. No mention of any numbers in it, unless it's some kind of riddle, but I don't see it. Did I try everything up here? Keeping poor track. Okay. Still concerned I might have missed that one door I didn't check on the ground floor, but that's the way we're headed anyway, so... Oh my god, why is she like this? I'm never gonna get used to it. Every time I move my torch around, she's just there. Stairs are still very much a challenge, <laughs> unfortunately. Maybe I should be strafing them more. It almost feels more laborious to do so, though, you know? Okay, so... Yeah, I didn't try Doctor's Lounge, apparently. Not sure how I missed it. And then Kitchen, I'm pretty sure, was blocked off. Which could be the case for Doctor's Lounge. We'll do the examination room first, because, you know... When in Rome. I used the key. So that's nice. Okay, it's not static, it's just spooky, spooky drone music. Oh my god. Every time. <laughs> I should expect it by now, but I just don't. Uh, there are medical records on the desk. Nothing particularly interesting. But that was the case before with the typewriter, and then there was something, so... Hmm? Okay. So where is this going? Is this like a different part of the room? Obviously a different room, but... So which door did I just... Okay, not that one. Shells, nice. <laughs> the locker's lock is broken. I don't know how you can even tell. She's kind of in the way. What have we got? Nothing? No phone. Third floor patient wing hall 7335. Okay. I just came from that, but that's helpful. That's definitely gone into the old memory banks, right? Nice. Oh wait, what? There's a memo hanging from the refrigerator. Food only, do not store drugs. Okay. So this room, I guess, is just that code? I always feel like I'm missing something, but it's so much harder to tell with her constantly just sucking up James's neck attention. He's always craning towards her and it makes it really difficult to detect where things are. Again, probably very conceptually, deliberately, but no less inconveniently. Very much more so for it. Well, not more so for the conceptual link, but now it's unlocked. So there's that. Is this the one I didn't try? Was it locked? Because it would make sense in terms of where I think I am. Yeah, okay. Hmm. Well. I think the best thing I can do right now is... Zoop back to the red square. Because I do need to go and take care of some stuff outside of the Silent Hill universe, unfortunately. 
pain me though it does to ever leave this wonderful place. I believe we're opposite the main door, right? Yes, okay. I think we made decent progress here. I think it went okay. Where are we up to now? Show me the shameful numbers. 514 on 19 saves, you know. We do what we can. And at least if something happens to us, we're in hospital, so... What better to be? Look after yourself.